Hi, this is Sailing vs Plastic and today we're gonna upcycle a used meal carton into a wallet. For that we need to find a meal carton or a juice carton and after we use that we need to rinse it and then we need to cut the top and the bottom parts of the meal carton and preferably leave it to dry. If you can't you can use some toilet paper to dry the inside and start working straight away. Once your top and your bottom is gone and your inside is dry, you need to fold your meal carton as we show in the video to build the shape of your wallet. It is important that you mark the folds well. Afterwards, we will locate the inside part of the meal carton, which is the folded one. Some meal cartons don't have it, so no worry if you don't find it. We use a card to make the measurements of our wallet and we fold as we show. First fold for the cart, second fold for the top of the lid. Make sure we leave a little bit of space because we want our wallet to be fat enough to put our coins in. Once we have our folds done, we'll start cutting our wallet. What I do is I mark with my nail on the sides of that second fold we did. I unfold the shorter sides in order to make it easier to cut and then I just find my mark that I did with my nails. Cut until the original folding and then remove the both of the corners of the top. My explanations are alright but the video shows it much better. Once you have both of the corners out, you should locate again your bottom side, as we say it. And only on that side, cut about 3 to 4 millimeters, so your shape is easier to fold afterwards. In that same side, we're gonna, we're gonna cut, as we show in the video, the inside of those corners. We make sure that we make them a bit round, you will see why later. Now, this is the magic trick. We fold it inside our wallet and then we can already see the shape of it. Normally, it takes a couple of tries to make it perfect the first time, and so did mine. So I did some retouchings. And I also redid the top, keeping that curved shape that I showed you before. Once that is there, check if your folding fits in the inside part of your wallet and you get the desired size and the desired space for the different areas. It is nice to cut the bottom, so your wallet will come out nicer and cleaner. Now that we have the wallet done, we're gonna invent something new. This was my first time trying this on this wallet, because this meal carton came with this lid. So I decided that I was gonna use the lid, so I was trying to upcycle all parts possible from the meal carton on the new invention. I first took off the lid of the milk carton, I cleaned it well, and then I placed it as shown in the video. I mark well with my finger as well with some scissors, and that's the area where we will have our lid or our closing cap, as it's gonna be. Once placed, we cut the circle in shape and we try and we test if our lid fits or if we need to do some extra cuts. This one fits well, so we close it up and we mark again on our top lid. 
same procedure as before, put the finger around, mark it well, get the scissors and cut again. Remember that this is an upcycling video for this milk carton, but it can be done with any carton. I've tried with the thin ones, tall ones, I've tried with the individual ones, the small ones I used to have when I was a kid. Even with the, with the tiny ones, they make for normally for cream, for cooking. Also, they work and they come out very nice to put some little precious stones or jewelry. So all cuts done, let's give it a try. Put our folding back, lid is there and everything fits. We get our top lid to check if we can close it and give it a good close and boom, we have it. That's it. Now we're gonna give a little final touch to this because we want it also to look beautiful. So we round the corners of the top and in this case I realized that the top part was a bit weak. So I decided to give that a little bit of support because I knew that after a couple of uses it would be broken. In this case I used some duct tape, thin one that I have, and I created a little bit of a reassurance around it. There's many ways you can do this. You can simply use duct tape everywhere and cut the hole in shape or get creative and build up your own reinforcement. So that's done. But with this new design, there was something that it was going to happen. You need both hands to open a wallet. You don't have to be holding your lid everywhere. So I decided that that needed to be attached. For that, I took some sail cotton or any strong cotton you find I did a hole in the top lid and I did a hole in the bottom of the lid to put it through both sides I reused some of the old offcuts of the mill carton to make the stoppers and once the thread the thread was through then I had already the lid being held by its own pass carton. And then I got my strong cotton that I cut in shape and burned the corners, took the other side of the cotton, put it through the bottom lid and repeated the same procedure also with an off cut of the mill carton. Once everything is held together, we push the lids back in place and we give it a last try. Close the middle carton, close the lid and off you go. So this is a great way to upcycle a meal carton that we use in our societies every day. Milk, juice, whatever you want. You can stick your card in there, you can stick your credit cards and all is done with scissors and no glue. I hope you like it. <laughs>